Okay, so I know I'm a little late in all, we're in November, but a couple of you had asked me about um, if I were going to do the Inktober challenge. Now, the Inktober channel for, challenge, for those of you who don't know, is like created by this artist, Jake Parker. Um, and I think it was a brilliant idea in which uh, I guess he did it for his own purpose, you know, when he originally came up with the idea, but it eventually became something that a lot of people actually took on. Um, and it's it's a challenge in which you do an ink drawing every day for the month of October and then you publish it on like a social media website and uh, I mean it's it's good for developing your work ethic in, in, in your drawing and also to explore ink and it's really just fun to do and I think it's a nice and innovative way to have people um, share their work and especially considering it's the same medium right now of course, you know, uh, I'm always drawing in ink, okay? Uh, so I think, like, I, I have Inktober every month. But I, th I think, I, I still feel like, you know, it was something really, really, really awesome. Um, and it brings awareness. And it's it just something fun for people who love drawing to do, okay? Now, um, I had a really busy month um, in October, but I figured I still wanted to do it. So I was thinking, like, how could I try to make up, right? So what I decided to do is I gritted this paper out in, like, six by... Five, so I have like 30 little blocks here, right? Um, and what I'm going to do is I am going to do 31 gesture drawings. <laughs> I think that's I think that's like my way of uh, making up for um, you know all of October. Okay, so each drawing will represent um, each day. Okay, there will be a drawing for each day of October. Um, so I, I think it would be a little fun thing to do.
that's pretty much it. So hopefully you guys had as much fun as I did. Um, it's, it's really fun. It's really liberating as a matter of fact. Um, <laughs> I don't think you can have any placements for um, gesture drawings. And you know what the fun thing is? Um, I had planned to do a gesture drawing like one per grid and it didn't work out that way at all. <laughs> it, it seems like they just took their lives as their own and um, I just went with it. You know, some were bigger than the others, and um, it, it just, it just, it just went as how it, it just came out. You know, um, I try to go with the feeling and not inhibit it. You know, just let it flow the way it came, and um, it was really fun. You should have sketchbooks filled with this stuff. All right, it's, it's like um, it's like exercising um, for your drawing. You know, it really trains you to loosen up. You know, um, and funny thing is. A lot of times, like really cool ideas come from this. Like you may find yourself referring or going back to this and say, "Wow, you know, I can think, I can use this for a, a finished work." You know, but it's um, you know, it's it's really fun, and uh, you know, hopefully you guys will uh, you know, go out and do some of this yourself. Have fun.